All right, YouTube, so I got a big one today. I've been waiting for something for a long time. We finally were able to get the confirmation a couple days ago that it was on its way. Got the notification or I guess email while I was at work today saying it got delivered. So I couldn't wait to get uh, to the house today. Been a, been a great week so far, so I just wanted to go ahead and throw that out there. This just kind of put the icing on the top and I, we're just gonna dive into it. For a second there, I thought, yeah, it was scamming people. I ordered this back in, I think it was Super Bowl, like Super Bowl weekend-ish, and didn't hear anything from it for what seemed like a while. I actually ended up making a separate order, like a couple, I wanna say maybe like a week or two ago for, for some other stuff, so. Um, we're still waiting on that package, but we got the first one in. So let's go ahead, let's open it up, let's go through it, and then we're gonna, we're gonna talk about what's inside, all right? So first off, I just wanna say thank you to everyone watching. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Wait till the end of the video. Let me know what you guys think, all right? Let's get on with it. All right, so big thing first, like it's just a basic shipping bag. I was kind of expecting a box, but I guess for what's inside, you don't really need a box. So um, I guess this will do. There's no damaged products. That's it. This is totally fine. I'm, yeah, I'm not worried about it. So let's go ahead and open it real quick. As you can see, I went ahead and purchased two items from Yeezy.com or Yeezy Supply or yeah, I think it's Yeezy.com. I don't even remember. I'll put down the link in the uh, description. But we went ahead and bought a pair of uh, the Yeezy Pods and then the Vultures uh, long sleeve t uh, shirt. Yeah. So let's go ahead and just dive into it. We're going to talk about it, get my opinion on it. We're going to try it on, try the pods on, see what see what the hype is about essentially. So we'll put away the, the tea for now and then we'll start off with the pods, right? So first off, this is a pretty cheap bag with a pretty cheap like drawstring. Kind of reminds me of those free drawstrings bags that you get at like events for like AT&T or like T-Mobile or these companies just giving out free drawstring bags that's what it feels like all right so I do wear a size eight and a half men's shoe eight and a half to nine men's shoe so I went ahead with a size one in the pods um, I was on that fringe like size one size two but I like my stuff a little bit tighter so I was like, you know what, let's just go with this smaller size and kind of go from there. I'm going to try it out. I kind of was seeing videos of, um, I, for I forgot who it was uh, on YouTube that they wore a size 9, but it was like sliding off their foot a little bit. So um, I just went ahead and went, and went with the size 1. So all in all, the sock layer kind of feels like my soccer socks from when I was playing as a kid. Um, doesn't seem all that great of a material to be honest, but for $20, I mean, you can't really complain. You know, we're, we were, personally, I wasn't expecting much. For $200, when they first originally dropped, like, these things are a scam, I'm not gonna lie. But, you know, Ye made it right. He refunded everyone else with that ended up paying 200 bucks for these. But all in all, I mean, for 20 bucks, I'm a huge Kanye uh, supporter, so um, gotta support the boy, right? So these things for sure have an insole inside of it. I honestly thought it was gonna be pod, pod, and then just sock with no support for your arch, but. Um, I feel like these would probably be a little bit comfortable, especially with, I mean, it, it feels, it feels pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. The sock feels, doesn't feel scratchy or anything like that, but, 
Yeah, it feels like it's gonna have support on there. These are very squishy. All in all, I mean, 20 bucks, why not? We'll go ahead and put those off to the side. Next thing is the Vultures um, long sleeve shirt. Honestly, I wasn't really, I wasn't really expecting much out of this. The fit kind of looked a little weird and I'm not sure if this is the neck opening or it's like, yeah. I mean, from what I've been seeing online, it's a pretty weird, pretty weird fit tee. So again, I'm a shorter dude. I went with the size one, I think. Uh, yeah, I think I went with the size one. I was debating between size one, size two, just because I like a baggier fit, but I, was, I just didn't want. It. I was like, you know what? We're gonna go size one. If it don't fit me, it'll fit my girl. So um, it seems really big, or at least baggy, just from first glance. You have your like unfinished edges kind of gives it a nice fit to it kind of like that like unhemmed edges or unhemmed like sleeves and unhemmed uh, bottom of the shirt this is probably something I've haven't seen out of a shirt personally and then yeah I think that size I think that's the size so size one this is something that I really haven't seen out of a shirt where I mean it looks it looks comfortable what can I tell you it looks comfortable, it doesn't seem like it has a, like a neckline or anything like that. So, I mean, we're gonna pop it on. We're gonna see how it fits. We're gonna, hopefully this thing fits good. That way we can rock this tee, make some fits with it, and then probably step out in the pods here um, one of these days. Um, I still don't know what I'm gonna wear with these, but you know, we're, we're gonna figure something out, right? So let me go. Let me go ahead. Let's throw this thing on and then kind of talk 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 about it right after. All right. All right. So at a first glance, it actually is really comfortable. Like this thing kind of fits really, really good. Like the the neckline feels close. I thought it was gonna be like down here, but it's close up to to your neck, kind of doesn't doesn't hang too much sleeves are pretty much like pretty good like look at that that's that's pretty solid so I I kind of I'm not gonna lie I'm not gonna hype this up but I really like this this cut so it, it fits like a glove I'm about 5'7 150 ish so um, this is the size one and I mean it, it, it's working pretty good like, I'm definitely gonna wear this out a little bit more often but like let me just step back a little bit to kind of show you guys I don't know if you guys can see that but like that looks pretty good just throw like a hat on or something you know like <laughs> The shirt, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10. I like the quality of the, of the, I guess cotton, or like the, I like the quality of the shirt. I like the fit of the shirt. I wasn't too sure of how it would fit, but I mean, size one for a 5'8, five, 5'7, five, I'm not gonna lie about my height now. 5'7, about 150. This, this fits like right on this spot. It's not too short. It's not too long. The edges do curl up a little bit to where, I mean, if you, if it was a little big, I guess you could kind of curl it up a little bit, but I mean, neck feels pretty good. Like it's up close right here. I mean, it is a little bit wider on this side, like since you have like weird cutout, but nonetheless, it's, it's a solid shirt, right? For 20 bucks, I might even order another one to be honest can't can't beat that price literally can't beat that price 20 bucks vultures tea 
just so you guys can see it up close and I think it's got a hit right here. I don't know if you guys can see that, but 10 out of 10, man. Kanye hit it out the door with this one. I'm not gonna lie, this fits, fits good. So now let's go ahead and try on the Easy Pods because that's one thing that I'm not even like 100% sure on. Do you wear socks with them? Do you don't? I mean, I guess it's gonna be kind of nasty if you don't wear socks, so, I mean, obviously we're gonna wear socks, right? Well, I hope everyone's wearing socks with these, but let's go ahead and try these on. All right, so I'm assuming this is gonna be the right one. This is gonna be the left one. Let's go ahead and put these things on. First things first, let's kind of get up, let's walk around, let's see if... I think I could kind of wear these around the house, around the crib. They don't feel too bad, I'm not gonna lie. They feel pretty comfortable. I think the one thing I don't like is how, like, how high the sock is. But you know, the higher the sock, the down of the full right. So we can do a quick sock check. Overall, I mean, I really like the way they, they fit. I'm not sure how they would fit or how comfortable they would be in the long run. I feel like my feet would get pretty tired after X amount of time. Um, but overall, I mean, I really don't think I'd wear them with jeans, maybe, especially not shorts, maybe with some joggers or some sweatpants or something, but I mean, I'll probably just wear them around the house to be honest. Overall, I think this Yeezy merch kind of lived up to its hype. I really like the quality. I think my favorite part and what I'll wear the most is going to be this t-shirt. So I might have to stock up and buy a couple more just because honestly, I really like the fits. Personally, I haven't seen anything like this. Maybe I'm just uh, living under a rock when it comes to fashion, but the Yeezy pods, I just don't feel like I'm going to wear them a lot or have many uses out of them. I think this is more of a just chill around the house, maybe go run an errand or so in them it's probably gonna make your foot really sweaty if it's hot so that's probably just out there and you probably don't even want to wear shorts with these you i feel like you'll kind of look kind of crazy with these maybe if they came out with all white ones that'd be kind of cool but yeah i don't know I, I just don't see myself wearing like jeans with these or or anything more than likely I'm gonna wear these around the house, but regardless, I love the idea. I love the fact that they're $20 for each one. I think the t-shirts, you should go get one. Ye isn't scamming. He's living up to his word with actually shipping these out and like letting the customers actually enjoy these products. I think his ad at the Super Bowl was phenomenal marketing wise it really made a lot of people start talking about it and kind of i think a lot of people just ordered just because i think it was pretty funny like i thought it was hilarious i was like you know what i'm gonna go buy some easy pods i'm gonna go buy a, a t-shirt or a long sleeve shirt i guess i don't know it's not a t-shirt but regardless um let me know what you guys think about the the yeezy merch um like comment subscribe I'll catch you guys on the next one. Once again, YouTube, this is Mal, logging out.